first will be Jing Haipeng, the captain of the mission. He will be the first to get out of the re-entry module uh, under the help of the ground staff, Jing Haipeng is getting out. <laughs> yes, we have seen him. Captain Jing Haipeng is on the ground. Uh, he's helped to be seated because he still has some difficulty adapting to gravity and hopefully making him more comfortable. He is uh, carried by the ground staff. He looks well and uh, in good spirit. And he's soon to be joined by two colleagues of his. So during the whole process of the re-entry, they still wear their in-cabin spacesuit. He's still laughing at us. Uh, that shows uh, he's in good shape. And uh, after such a long journey, um, all the astronauts should have felt a little tired and exhausted, uh, but they will get a recuperation process here on the ground. Yeah, Tiangong One is a totally new experience for the astronauts. It's yeah. a much larger space because than the Shenzhou. Uh, there are another astronaut uh, that will come out of the spacecraft. Uh, that's uh, astronaut Liu Wang. He successfully uh, did the manual docking with Tianggong Wang. This is the first time China ever conducted a manual docking with a space vehicle. And is also a key step for the assembly of future space station. That's why we, we tested this mission. And uh, manually docking is done by astronaut Liu Wang. <laughs> astronaut Liu Wang is also on the ground. But this is not the first time that Shenzhou has carried three astronauts at the same time. Yes. Uh, in Shenzhou 7, yes. they have also conducted the same thing, and they even uh, made the first EVA on yeah, that mission. Yeah, of course. Mr. Chai Zhigang, Mr. Liu Boming, and also yes. our commander, Mr. Jing Haipeng, yes, in indeed. Shenzhou 7 mission. And Cosmod Jing Haipeng, the captain of this mission, also served in the Shenzhou 7 mission. Uh, back then, China conducted uh, the first EVA, another important milestone for space exploration. This is an uh, astronaut, Liu Wang, saluting the crowd. So, just left the one in the uh, spacecraft. That's uh, China's first female astronaut, Liu Yang. Uh, we were told that females were supposedly having a harder time adapting to gravity than males. Yes. Uh, because, uh, of course, their muscles are uh, less strong than their female counterparts. They will have a much more difficult time adapting to the gravity. But females have also their advantages, we were told, uh, when they were in space. Uh, what do you think? 
Yes, I actually asked our, uh, before coming here, our head of our